All right. Oh, man. Hey, guys. How's it going? Nas here. This is art vlog number two. So uh, what I've done today, <laughs> last vlog went up two days ago, like a day ago, something like that, whatever. I have since cleared up my art space and uh, put up some more shelves. I need more shelves. I'm going to put up way more boards, all that stuff, kind of like these, you know, but more of them and different like library wall style, like I mentioned before. But anyway, this isn't uh, about that. But yeah, kind of organized more stuff. Uh, it's still a mess, but I kind of know what's where. So once I decide where all the shelves are, that's where it's all going to go. So technically, it's not that bad anymore. I uh, threw out a whole bunch of my uh, Power Rangers uh, legacy boxes for the figures. I, I mean, I don't need them... Why waste space? I mean, space is valuable. My studio room here is small, as you can see. I'm filming with a fish, fish eye, so hold on a second. <laughs> That's too close. A little too close. So this maybe will give you more of a claustrophobic feel. But it'll be nice. I have a perfect light set up here. So I can film something in the middle. I have a left and a right. I love the view. I'm up in a magnolia tree. <laughs> So, um, yeah, I've been, like, trimming that tree for maybe 10 years now to kind of wrap around the house. So, yeah. But anywho. <clears throat> so, what I'm doing now. So, this thing, I've actually... Let's see. I don't know if you can tell. The sheen. Yeah, you can. So, like, I've uh, glued everything. As you can see, there's no bubbles, really, that I can tell right now. Everything's pretty solid. I'm pretty happy. That's gonna look really cool right there when it's uh, cut out and they're actually floating in 3D space. But anywho, you can probably get the sense of movement already with certain cuts I have here, so that's gonna be cool. So here's what I did. But uh, anyway, the next step for this is cutting with X-Acto. I'm gonna cut out sections and then, you know, gently cut it out around where I've cut already. Makes sense? Alright. It's a lot of tedious work. A lot of tedious work. That's why, you know, whatever. So yeah. That's a 10-year-old project that I'm still working on. It's for myself. That's why I'm not in a rush. I still need the... It's made of entirely of Tommy's Zords. There's the White Tiger Zord. There's a whole bunch of stuff that's not on him yet, obviously. But uh, yeah, this is a very, very very long time coming but anyway more on that later stick around i have a lot of projects happening like this one for mel this is the doom gun that's gonna be steampunk style but the new one i forget the number of it but you know the one that uh, has these things kind of come out and it powers up it looks pretty cool there's like a blue light on the inside there <laughs> i painted that blue but uh yeah this one i'm making for my buddy mel that's gonna be awesome once i'm done I just need the right parts, but anywho, back to 3D collage, or my pop art montage, as I've deemed it now. So here's my Imaginex pieces, let me get more to the light here, and here's what I've done. I've gone heavy at this with like a, with that saw and a bunch of hacksaws and just kind of cut around to make this part not take up room, you know. See, like, half of it's gone. So that once it's inside of a collage, as you can see right now, like, that would be, you know, it would kind of be, like, right there. I hope you get what I mean. Got rid of some unnecessary stuff so that it can go plush with the back. So I've done that to him. I've done that to this poor bastard. Got a lot more out of him. He's gonna be inset a lot deeper into the collage. But as you can see, this one's cut that way, this one's cut this way, because this one's gonna be on the right, that one's gonna be on the left. So here's Sabretooth, same thing, it's gonna be on the right. I'm as I go, I'm gonna you know keep cutting them. Uh, who knows, in the end I might end up just using you know Mestodon's head. It, it all depends on how all those collage pieces go together. 
uh, pterodactyl, I'm gonna cut the neck so that I can bend the head forward so that it could be within the collage kind of like that. And you can see his face. Her face, I don't know. This guy I'm still not sure about. I might just put him in the bottom, but I really don't like these ports with the Imaginext. So I already started cutting it in half. Uh, kind of left them alone for now. If you're not sure, you know, let it be. So yeah, that's what I'm doing with these guys. Oh yeah, this is more stuff for him. He, he's gonna be epic, but uh, yeah. I'm still gonna pose him. He's gonna be more of a statue. You can't really do stuff with him, but it's gonna be an epic statue. Like mid-flight with a crazy sword and crazy mid-transformations happening. I, I can't wait for this to happen, but need time, need money. I am an artist, you know. This thing I broke in a move, so my custom original turtle wheels like I have here broke off. I found one, but I don't know where the other one is, but anyway. So this bad boy. Spent a lot of time on him too. A lot of detail painting. This was all white, you know. Even these things I painted, all the framing, every little detail, all the silver. This was fun to do. That was a lot of work too. That was all like this color before. Anyway. It's getting warm in this room. <laughs> so yeah guys, I'm gonna continue work on cutting that up and then I need to figure out, the uh, main thing to figure out is I have a ton of frames, I have a ton of uh, like paintings also from flea markets that I got for like a buck or two dollars. So I need to figure out if I'm gonna add like my own paint behind it, kind of like my uh, Silver Surfer piece. Check out my Instagram, um, nostalgic underscore art. Um, there's a Silver Surfer piece. I painted the back, like the whole orb of, what's his name, the, you know, his boss or, you know, the guy that owns him, makes him do stuff. Uh, yeah, check that out. So I feel like I want to do more, incorporate my own paintings into things. So like just paint over an old canvas, kind of like that thing, you know, I'll paint over that or add to that, like some collages I do. But, um, anywho. Um, yeah, no, I'm not gonna show you guys the other stuff. But yeah, alright. Oh, oh, man. Oh, yeah. So yeah, I'm still figuring out where everything's gonna go, that's why I'm still building this all up. So, anywho. So yeah, guys, uh, that's it. Uh, gonna call it for this vlog number two. Art vlog of Nostalgic. So yeah, stick around. The more views I keep getting on these, the more I'm gonna keep, you know, paying more attention to the videos as far as, you know, I could have filmed myself cutting that stuff, but you know, uh, it takes up time, you know. So anywho, you guys understand. You understand, fellas and ladies. So yeah. Okay guys, stick around. Uh, more art vlogs coming up. Keep watching, comment, ask me questions if you wanna see certain things or um oh yeah there's like an update on my mustang thing uh, let's see uh there we go this is how much mustangs i have for my mustang project it's not even 100 yet it's about 85 90 about about there so uh, i'm doing good but i need twice that much so like full bin of that or like one and a half of those obviously the more the merrier that's my childhood collection of Hot Wheels. This is my um, sealed Hot Wheels and other 164 scale cars. This is like an impromptu <laughs> collection tour without showing you anything. But uh, this is what I mostly love to collect, which is just movie cars and stuff like that. You know, the DeLorean, Scooby machine there, Mystery Machine. Uh, but yeah. Oh yeah, also, fun segue. Uh, I'm gonna do a video soon of opening this bad boy. This was a gift for me from Maggie's mom. And uh, this is limited. It says it's somewhere. Oh yeah, one of 7,000. It's like a remastered reprint, blah, blah, blah. But yeah, I wanna open this up, see what it looks like, see what inserts are in there and stuff like that. And I can't wait to listen to this thing. So I'm gonna do uh, open that in a video or do it live, whatever, you know. That's it, guys. 
thanks everyone for watching i'm really gonna go this time thank you <laughs> so yeah thanks for watching this vlog number two um so yeah it's gonna be a lot more art stuff happening but uh check out my instagram nostalgic underscore art uh you'll see what i do how my collages look like and most of the ones on my instagram they're all sold so i only have like six at the moment that i kind of take with me to shows to show people what they look like but obviously i'm making more so stick around there's gonna be a lot a lot of art happening i can't wait to get all this you know made i want this all to be cozy so that i can like be happy there's gonna be my collection stuff back there and i'm gonna make my work here and editing station over there so right now all i have is this phone but i'm about to uh go to geek squad get my mac fixed hopefully so yeah stick around see you guys later have a great wonderful day you're all awesome later